Republicans retake Congress, we will fight and we will win for Ohio once again. We are going to win. We are going to win bigger and better and stronger than even before. This week, a Trump-appointed judge liberated Americans from Joe Biden's oppressive mask mandate. With all of the stories I read, I just didn't read anything about the fact that and I was very proud to appoint that judge. I was very proud of what she did. And uh, it's a great appointment. She did something very brave. But now the administration is appealing the decision. And we have to have our freedoms. With a Republican Congress, we will also protect parents' rights. No teacher should ever be allowed to teach transgender, transgender, to our children without parental consent. Isn't it amazing how that's become such a big subject? And who would even think that that would be a big subject? think we'd be talking about that? Who would even think that would be a subject where it gets, like, the biggest hand of all? Who would think it's possible? And, you know, while we're at it, we don't want men competing in women's sports. Is that okay? You saw the recent race, the, the swimming meet, where uh, an 11-year-old record and they had one young lady. She was going to break that record by one-eighth of a second. She's been working for years. She's going to break that record. And the gun goes off, and a guy broke it by 38 seconds. He went by her so fast, she got windburn in the pool. The best, though, are the weightlifting records, you know? A record that stood for, I think, 17 years, I read. And this woman, you know, they put a tiny little quarter of an ounce on one side of those big barbells and they put, and like it's 208 pounds or whatever the hell, and she's getting up. And she, she's so proud she got it up here and she's ready to. Uh, then she didn't quite make it, but she'll make it. But here's the problem this guy gets up. Bing, bing. <laughs> they said, Have you lifted before? No, I haven't really. It's so ridiculous. And, you know, people aren't supposed to talk about it. Even the young ladies that are being just beaten so bad, so unfair. It's so unfair. They talk about women's sports. It's so unfair. And yet, the women that are getting beaten don't want to talk. They said, do you have any comment? No, no, I'd rather not comment. I'm not afraid to comment. I'll comment. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous.